the more I play this, the more I'm excited uh, to, to see the, the next game coming up. I think this game's actually coming out for uh, 360 and PS3, actually, pretty soon. PS4. I don't know. It's coming out the console soon. Oh, god damn it. That's fine. No, no, no town can be, uh, can be doing so good. I mean, this is pretty a post-apocalyptic as it gets, and, uh, survival horror as it gets. The dredger is just <laughs> basically smart zombies. Sort of. Yeah, pretty much. So, I mean, they're just like, boo, look at me. Boo. This is reminding me more and more of the road, which is, uh... Oh, that's just not good. That's not good. <laughs> that movie, uh, that movie hit me in funny ways. What is this mess about? Looks like a full-scale battle happened, and recently. But only dredge bodies remain. Maybe we'll see something from the tower. Have Varl search the buildings and make sure that there's no dredge waiting to spring on us. On it. And don't set up camp or make a fire. We'll take a look and then get out of here before anything else goes wrong. I wonder if camping increases the chance of... Nah, nah, it doesn't. You mean more wrong. God, I hate you, Luden. I just, I just want to slap you. Okay. So we get a moment to either check out our cool heroes and level them up or... Uh, check out the tower. Well, which... gotta level up those heroes. Which I've been neglecting so badly. <laughs> uh, I have a feeling. Whoa, what the fuck? What's up? The lead singer of Motorhead died. Wow, really? Huh. At well, he was seventy. I guess that's true. I mean he wasn't young. And and you know, he drank a bottle of Jack every day of his life, so you know. <laughs> it's not too crazy. Yeah. Oh, it's still a bummer, though. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. Back to the undead dead thingies. Dredge. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm gonna play this the coward's way. I'm gonna just have a nice big ol' fat line here, and hopefully I can block him up. Actually, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna block myself up way too much. I really need to switch out one of the barrel really badly. If I move in here, the archers will be able to come around here. So I should probably actually come in from here. Then I can kind of set up a defensive line as these grunts move in. Okay, there we go. I, uh, I, I made the thing that's braining. Not very well, but it, it's there all the same. So, Hakon's first. I should put him there for a second. Do it like. Can I, can I... Nope, that's the order they're in. I should have reordered it. That's fine. I did not notice this Varl over here, just kind of poking his head out and watching. <laughs> He's like, hey, what's going on over here, kids? Oh, 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 I, I, I didn't realize. Uh, well, this. What, are, what are you damn kids doing knocking on my door? Get off my lawn. Uh, oh, oh, there's, there's Dredge. I'll just, just watch. I guess. I, I don't know what else to do. I wonder if you can go talk to him. Well, that's the uh, that's the old one. Nah, he's he's just observing the battle because he found the first one. But after that, he's just been watching. Once he got enough party members, he's like, "Oh, okay, I'm a tax collector. I'll just watch." What you all doing over here? Or you can go that way. That's also fine. Fucking dredge. We we make no sense. Huh, yeah. Well, I think they saw exactly what I was thinking. They're just gonna, they're gonna go the, the other way around. S smart undead creatures. Smarter than I am, at least. Just kind of sad when that's it's just a pitchy game. Okay, I'll draw them out. It's fine. It's not really 
what I want to do. It's fine, I guess. Hmm. <laughs> it's kind of a stale mix. Okay, I'll, I'll go over here. Oh, I'll go over here. Well, fine, I'll just do this over here then. want to finish him. Uh, that's fine. Whatever, I'll just kill this one real quick. There's still a little room, so that's good. That's fine. You can also go that way. I don't really have much options otherwise. I wish they made a, uh, a Dark Souls uh, strategy game. That'd be pretty cool. Or Dark Souls? Demon Souls? You know, the, the whole shebang. I got enough of those damn games that at this point I think it technically counts as a series. Yeah, well, for computer players, you pretty much only got to play uh, Dark Souls. Which is One good. And two. It's good. I, I liked it. Yeah. I want to play Bloodborne, though. The game looks so fun. From it's a, all dark, and gritty, and gothic. Mm -hmm. Well, from a gameplay standard, it's actually really different because they focus more on... Uh, they fo focus more on being aggressive. So while you could just sit back and you know do the usual where like you attack, you roll all the way, you attack, you roll all the way, it's they expect you more to actually hit. You go for it being offensive because when you're offensive, and of course now I draw them out once I moved away. Um, when you're offensive, um, when you get hit, like so your your HP goes down, but you can actually regain it from hitting them. You are like stealing their blood, quote unquote. Hmm. So it's it's actually kind of a neat. Um, it's a neat mechanic of the game that they're they're rewarding you for you know actually doing something instead of just hiding. Which is which is good because in Dark Souls it's like I am going to run in circles until I can get behind you and then attack and then run. No, I, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Get I'm gonna harm you. Yeah, so it's either you play the, I have no armor, because you're, you know, going for being fast and smooth, or you're going for the, I have all the armor, therefore I take no damage. So this game, uh, or this game, Bloodborne, they actually do have, you know, some uh, equipment modifiers, but it's very minimalistic in comparison to Bloodborne, or the Demon Souls and Dark Souls and all that. It's, it's basically amounts to, hey, well, well, it looks cool. You, you like how this looks? Okay, there you go. Here's your outfit. Mm -hmm. Have fun with it. And, and then there's some, uh, there's some quest-related stuff where it's like, oh, hey, if you go in wearing the, you know, church outfit, they'll be like, oh, you're a church guy. And you're like, yeah, sure. Whatever. Do whatever you said. If it gets me the, uh, the things, yes. Yes, I am. God damn it, move to me! I'm sick of this stalemate. <laughs> We're gonna run around in circles. It's like, you're gonna you're gonna come for us, right? No. Okay, well, we're not coming towards you. Okay. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna, gonna waddle a little bit forward. Stop. Oh. Alright, I, uh, I did not plan this out right. I should have moved a little bit I have a plan. No, I don't. I had a plan. Fine. You at one point had a plan. It's that plan is now bunk. Yeah, that, that, now it's her turn, but that's all right. I'll, I'll do the fire after cover. If I get that opportunity still. Oh, 
my archer. It's one of those things I probably would have figured this out by now if I actually was paying attention. But, yeah. Well, you know, it's it's just it's so hard to pay attention when in games now. No, seriously. Like, I play so many multiplayer games because I just can't pay attention to anything. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm joking, but... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Like, when I pay, play... When I play by myself, da -da -da -da. you know, I definitely pay more attention. Da -da 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 -da. Ha! But, uh, you know, it's it's definitely a lot easier to go, oh, hey, that's that's what's going on. This guy's game. Oh wow. Much, and so much for that. And whap. In the face. How right, Nikisa? Here, I can finish this guy off. Crap. Oh, just stab him right through. Should the blood come off of that weird undead thing? Yeah, really. And I he's mean, down. Like, what is that? Is that a, like, it's not a sword. It's like a club with a stick or with a pointy end on the end. Yeah, I don't even know what that weapon is either. It's really cool though, I like it. <laughs> I'd uh, I'd totally do something like that. <sighs> Super unrelated, but uh, you know the Conan movie, right? Yeah. From the 80s, the, the awesome one. So, uh, it, it was, while well, it was filmed in uh, Italy and all that, it's, uh, it's a Universal Studio movie though. So, having said that, uh, at the Universal Park, Universal Studios Park, uh, mm -hmm. they actually had like a show, kind of like how they have Waterworld now. They uh, they had a Conan the Barbarian show, which oh cool. It, it, apparently, it ended in the '90s. I I never got to see it. I was way too young when it came out. I think it was like '93 or no, actually. Oh yeah, that was like before my ability to watch anything like that for sure. Mm -hmm. Actually, I think it might end in the 80s. Anyway, but yeah, it's what, what a cool idea. Like they actually had like a, like a serpent temple, and they had a, they had the actors, you know, come down on ropes. And, you know, fast. And the reason I'm saying this is just because uh, they look like, uh, super cool, uh, like keep going on. I wish there were more things like that. I agree. It's be cool. You could have done. To, oh, you don't want to kill people with him anymore, right? Exactly. It's like I, I don't want to kill him, but I'm gonna not. You know. So it's like I'm gonna focus with these two, trying to get that last. Not kill. you. Oh, that'll do it. I like that. Bonk. Well, they have it. Yeah, I think I saw. I went to the Water World thing uh, when I was really like, I was like seven or something. Uh huh. Yeah, that was pretty cool. I mean, the the uh, the Water World uh, thing at Universal Studios is probably better than the movie. Hey, oh, um, I, I kind of like. I actually like the movie. Um, I think the show is pretty cool. It's still going on. That's the mind blowing thing. That's amazing that enough people would go to it. Like, I, like I feel like people now wouldn't even like know what it is. Like they go in and just be like, oh, there's this this weird post apocalyptic thing. It's kind of like Mad Max but with water. Yeah, what, what, what is this? Oh, it's a movie. Oh, is it coming out next year? No, it, it came out in 95. Oh. It's a, it's, it's, guys, it's, it's Mad Max Waterworld. <laughs> That's how I always try to try to advertise it, but I don't think anyone else really thinks about it like that. <laughs> I just think what the, the, that's what people think when they're like going to Universal Studios. It's like they, they got this Waterworld thing that looks like Mad Max. Maybe it's Mad Max Theory Waterworld. <laughs> <laughs> You lean on a crumpled wall, watching endless waves of dredge marching below. Satisfied, Hakon, Mogaras? The vast number of dredge remind you of the Great Wars. I've seen enough, you reply. Let's get out of here. Mogar Let's get out of here! Let's get out of here! <laughs> Mogar stands over the bodies of the man and woman. What? Oh, the ones in the corner. Think the slide came up here for those two? Asked Mogar, waving his bladed weapon in their direction. Uh, any idea who they are? The man is dressed in light clothes unfit for travel in the north. The woman wears an ornate but simple robe and shawl. No, but something's wrong about this, says Mogur. 
He pauses and puts his ear to the man's chest. This one's still alive, he says. The girl is not. The clang of metal reaches you from the, con er, from the courtyard below, muffled by the thick snow. You curse. Quick, back down. Bring the live one. You skip stairs as you descend, shouting orders to the world below. Dredge line the battlefield, weapon drawn. A fight seems inedible. Oh, come on, we already had a fight! You take a quick head count. There must be at least Oh my high. gosh. Okay. Uh. uh charge. Start comparing the weaknesses and strength. Take into account terrain, morale, and the look of the enemy. If you're careful, you should be able to keep your foot. Force of balance. Give the order. Start rallying your forces. Gather your allies to you. Preparing to enter the fray. But yeah, uh, on YouTube, I, I found a, uh, well, we want you out of there anyway. And I guess we want you out of there for now. We don't have enough heroes. Um, on YouTube, I, I found uh, the Waterworld show, the Universal show, but from Japan on there. It's, it's pretty freaking funny. They, uh, they overemphasize certain things like Dustin Hoffman, at least the one I saw, because they, they have actors that they'll change up from time to time, but uh, the Japanese Dustin Hoffman was pretty funny. Uh, so he's the, he's the bell ringer. He's the one that smacks people around. We've got some grunts. Vicious grunt. Dredge grunt. Oh, okay, so he's just a stronger one. I get you. So I don't know. If that's something that sounds up your alley, that, that, that's worth checking out because it's, it's pretty goddamn funny. Definitely. Bonk. Bonk. Just, just, just face smacking. Bam. 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 At uh, Costco, they actually had uh, they had some of the uh, called annual tickets, I guess. Like it's a year ticket thing. It was like 50 bucks, which is basically what it costs to go in for a day anyway at Universal Studios. So, if you live around the... Well, I guess... I don't know if we'd have it in your area. They should, but I don't, I don't actually know. Uh, but that sounds like your thing. It might be worth might be checking out, because... I thought that was super cool, even if I only got to go once. But I was going to go anyway. For yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Man, you never know. You just end up in L.A. for whatever random reason. Oh, he just got punked in the face. Okay, he did get one shot. That was that was dumb. That was really dumb on my part. Right, uh, uh, no, I can't really have him hide like that though. It's all from here. Well, actually, I'm going to uh, going to L.A. this Saturday. Sunday. Sunday. Cool. Yep, uh, I'm going to Disneyland. Oh yeah, go to Disney, guys. It's so cool. That's, it's not like I'm gonna die in my late twenties. Full going to Disneyland. Hey, you know what? There's no such thing as being adult. There's just various stages of being a responsible kid. I, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember how the rest of that goes. But... I did. I didn't. I didn't know I was going with anything. I was just on. That was just off the top of my head. All the better. Then. Well, uh, apparently, yeah, inadvertently quoting things. Yeah! No, just, just claim the quote. Everyone said everything. And he was down one shot. God damn it! I think bad things are going to happen. Uh, this is not good. I probably should have uh, not gone the way I went. But, uh, yeah, apparently it's still the, the diamond anniversary, because it's the 60th anniversary of uh, Disney, so would be. I, I kept wanting good. to go, but I uh, just couldn't make it. Well, uh, I think it lasts until like eight or something. And also, since they're uh, they're changing up the park a lot for the new Star Wars Land that's going to be coming out soon. I soon, I mean like in the next five years. But uh, they're going to take out uh, they're going to take out certain parts of the park. None of, the, none of the, like, really good stuff, so not like Space Mountain or anything, but uh, they're taking out... Why are they taking out? Future, future play place, I think. They're not taking it tomorrow. They're not taking it out Tomorrowland. Um, they should. 
Tomorrowland is like 1980s. Re re needs to be retrofit badly. <laughs> That's my favorite part of the park. <laughs> okay, but the like the computer things and stuff. Like last time I was there, they needed an update desperately. <laughs> Oh, the, um, yeah, okay, no, that's, that's the, the techno technology area. They've, uh, they've yes. actually, it's still there, kind of, but now it's essentially, it's, uh, it's the Avengers Tower, basically. They're like, hey, how can we, how can we squeeze Marvel into this? All right, here, here, here we go. Okay, because, like, I mean, the rest of it I love, but, like, that one area is what I remember most distinctly is really needing an update. Yeah. They're, they're taking out the, uh, near Frontierland, there's this, uh, like, petting zoo area. So they're, they're, they're taking that out. Which I don't really care about. And they also had, like, there's a barbecue little area thing there. And it's like 15 bucks for barbecue, so. Not a big loss in my, in my mind. I guess, I guess for Disney, it's not that bad. Yeah. Oh yeah, so hey, Ski, my man, uh, your your mics kind of kind of sound crazy. You sound like a robot or something. Oh, what the hell? What the heck? Yeah. Uh, is this, is this, is this any better? No, it's it's all scram. It's almost like staticky and honestly, it's just, it's just worse, so it's it just kind of sounds like you're in Tron. <laughs> uh, 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 It's, it might be Skype. Hmm. Well, uh, I'd say try unplugging them. Ugh. Of course, they throw more of these guys at us. Um. I don't know. We we might have to. Oh. That was nice. uh, sorry about that. Nah, it's okay. It's it's just. That that fix it. Fix it. Nope. It's, it's still there. I, I wonder if it's. Skype, he went robotic robotic robotic. Yeah. Um, here, I'll, I'll, I'll call you back in a second. I'm going to see if... Sounds I'll... good. Let's do... Nope. Uh, nope. Alright. That's cool. Alright. How you doing, bud? Uh, testing. Ah, okay. You sound good. Your volume's really low. It's the only thing. Also, I'm not sure if you're talking. Alright, are you there, bud? I, I can't hear you if you're talking. Okay, uh, no, I cannot hear you. I cannot hear you. So. Uh. I'm assuming this is really exciting for everybody watching this and listening to this. That's <laughs> eh, okay. Are you there, bud?
Okay. Oh, there you are. Let me try and plug my thing back in now. Okay. Also, I just got my ass handed me. That was loud, but I can hear you now. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not trying. Can to... you hear me now? Yes, and actually, the volume's really good. Okay, I think I found the problem. My uh, plug-and-play USB thing was just like, I'm not going to work anymore for the next 20 seconds. Ah, I... So next time that happens, I just need to unplug and plug in, and we'll, we'll just we'll just have to deal with the uh, fallout from that. Okay, yeah, well, we'll, we'll figure it out, but now we know. Also, I totally just got my ass hand to me. Uh, everyone is dead. Everyone is, is... dead. Your everyone are... is dying. Your dog is dead. You are dead. I don't remember how the rest of it goes. Actually, I, I, I think I said it right, but... I, I don't know. Uh, Friday the 13th on NES. Uh, when you get a game over, the game's like... Oh. <laughs> you are dead. Your friends are dead. Game over. It's, uh... It's pretty dark. Uh, are you going to turn on the screen sharing? Uh, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Oops. Uh, I, uh... This, this is all happening. I... Swear. There we go. Oops. Bonk. Oops. <laughs> bonk. I could probably edit that out. I probably should. We'll just we'll, we'll edit that in the section out. And just delete it. <laughs> uh, sorry for the brief uh, change in scenery, everyone. We lost the battle and my connection. Whoops. Which actually kind of go hand in hand when you think about it. Yep. Please hit 60%. Yeah! We're beating the percentages, ladies and gentlemen. And she gets smacked in the face. That's just dandy. Nope, 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 nope. attack. That's a show I haven't seen in a while. Of course, I'm not even thinking of Yay, alright. Doing this battle a lot better. A lot less uh, sitting and staring at each other going, alright, are you gonna are you gonna make the first move? No? I'll just I'll just wait. Everyone, let's circle around each other continuously. Are, are, are you, no? Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Oh, did you, did you want to go first? No, I'm sorry. The Canadian War. Everyone's too polite to make the first move. Oh, I'm sorry. No, oh, no. oh, sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no, please. Uh, you, know, you, you may go. No, no, no. I'm sorry. You you may go. Suddenly, like, there's just a war that breaks out. But there's not, not actually ever any battles because they're just apologizing to death. <laughs> Both the armies starve because no one's willing to make a move. <laughs> the Canadian Civil War. Oh, I'm <laughs> sorry. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll let you do what you want to do. Yeah, I, there, there would never be a Civil War. Like, if uh, someone wanted to, to stop following the Queen, and they'd be like, Well, I respect your opinion. I'll, uh, I'll allow you to continue to have your belief. Well, I will also let you have your opinion. Okay, well, I guess. Our That's all <laughs> <laughs> Let's put a hack on the back. Because I just get slapped around anyway. Yeah, uh, it gets smacked around a little bit. <laughs> How they like it. Oh my. My. And he runs. Kinda wish there was a healer in this game. I wonder if it would. Yeah, it's, I don't know. It'd throw, the, it'd throw the game like off though. It'd be too weird. I don't care. I think it'd be awesome. But I love healers, so. So do I. So do I. I. I think they get a bad rep in uh, most games. Well, I, th I think D and D is where you lose the healers because it's like, well, you can have a character that heals and it does heal them. However, uh, you could also just do that damage in combat and kill the things faster. So what do you do? Well, that's why I like to do the nice middleman of either the paladin or the cleric because. Clerics can actually whoop some serious ass if you, you know you throw some armor and like a mace on them. They'll be fine, you know. Clerics are broken. I agree. It's just 
it's it's uh, especially if your DM is not a not a like a they just let you do anything. Just clerics just are just like I am permanent C divine meta magic. The persistent spell divine meta magic. And then the game's over. That's that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Well, I think the other problem is when they go, oh, hey, what god are you following? Oh, I, uh, I wanted to make up my own god. Uh, he wants to do uh, these uh, two domains that are really unrelated, but uh, that's what I want to do. You just, just want the domain spells, don't you? No, no, no. It's, uh, it's, it's for the... Uh... God damn it, yes it is. Uh, yeah. I mean, there is a god that can do any domain, but it, it's kind of a dumb... It's kind of a dumb one. Like, I, I'm totally for, like, making your own god, but you better be able to, like, back like, back that shit up, like, super hard, like, why, why do you, like, like, I have a, I have a, I have a cleric that I'm playing right now that has, like, I think he's, like, planning and hunger, mm-hmm. and, but he worships the mists of Ravenloft, so, okay. um, the whole, the whole idea is, uh, he, he, he became feral, um, he's a he's a feral templated cleric, so he became feral because of Ravenloft, and so planning, you know, you, you get lost in the mists if you if you don't know where to go and how to plan to move forward. Um, and hunger is just an ever present thing in the wastes of Ravenloft. So it made it made sense if you it, because he he found that there were no actual gods in Ravenloft. Yeah, and they... so he be, he started to worship the the mists as the only thing that. Had any kind of power and consistency that could be could be truly seen. Yeah, that actually makes a lot of sense, especially since like in Ravenloft, the uh, like gods gods effects are really minimalized because you know, you're you're in your own little pocket play. You know? Yeah, which is far really far away from like Pelor. Like Pelor just goes like you can you can hear him echoing like ah oh 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 here. It's like Pelor can't hear you. It's like dude, I can't even see the sun. Hey God, uh, my heels don't work. Did you uh, did you rest? Uh huh. Mm. Did you did you, uh, tu- did you turn your monitor off and on? <laughs> did you uh, did you remember to slot them? Uh huh. Hmm. What's your what's your wisdom? It's, it's a good fifteen or sixteen. And you shouldn't be having. Huh. Sure. Oh. Well, um, well, can't help you. You're in Ravenloft. You're fucked. <laughs> Might wanna, might wanna reclass. Yeah, it's 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 terrible when like heal spells like do half, and uh, 